to another trendy Talia video. My name is Talia for those of you who may be new here and as you can see we're back in my kitchen again today. I am back with my second video for my Girly Bake With Me series and today I'm going to be baking a homemade strawberry shortcake sandwich. This is another perfect treat for the summertime with the strawberries. We're going to be doing homemade whipped cream as well and of course as you know a homemade pound cake. So if you guys would like to see how I make that, then let's go ahead and get started. I'm starting off by preheating the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. Then I'm going to grease my 9x5 baking tin and sprinkle a little flour to keep my bread from sticking to the pan once I'm ready to take it out. For the pound cake you will need 4 eggs, 1 cup of butter, 1 and a half cups of all purpose flour, 1 cup of sugar, half cup of sour cream, 2 tablespoons vanilla extract, half teaspoon baking powder, and 1 teaspoon salt. In a medium mixing bowl whisk together the flour, salt, and baking powder then set it aside. Next you're going to want to cream together the sugar and butter with a mixer. Adding in the eggs one at a time you're going to want to set your mixer at medium speed. Scrape the bowl down and beat until everything is mixed together. Now to add in the sour cream and vanilla extract, make sure it's all blended together and then add the dry ingredients. Again, make sure you scrape down the bowl so that everything is mixed together nicely. Time to transfer the batter over into the tin and make sure you smooth the batter with a spatula. I ended up baking my pound cake for 55 minutes at 350 degrees. While the pound cake bakes, I cut some strawberries and added 2 teaspoons of sugar. This helps sweeten the strawberries and gives them that juicy sweet flavor. For the whipped cream you will need 1 cup of heavy cream, 1 teaspoon vanilla extract, and 2 tablespoons of powdered sugar. Mix the heavy cream and vanilla extract first on medium speed for about 45 seconds. Add in the powdered sugar and turn the speed up to high. Keep a close eye on this part. It should only take about a minute or less to start turning into whipped cream. You'll know it's done once it forms a stiff peak on your whisk.
Once you take the pound cake out of the oven, let it cool before making your strawberry shortcake sandwich. Now for the fun part, putting together our sandwich. You can either scoop the whipped cream on the pound cake or make it look fancy like I did and put it in a piping bag. Top it with strawberries Then add another slice of pound cake on top and voila, you have yourself a strawberry shortcake sandwich. I just love how girly this dessert look. It looks like something you would serve at a tea party or a picnic, and it tastes wonderful. When I think of dessert in summertime, I always think of strawberry shortcake. And if you haven't checked out the strawberry pound cake collection at Bath & Body Works, then you're missing out. This fragrance smells so good. I own almost everything from the collection. You can either eat your dessert like a true sandwich, or if you're a princess like me, you could use a fork. Thank you all so much for watching my girly bake with me homemade strawberry shortcake sandwich. I hope you all enjoyed this recipe and if you do decide to try it out at home yourself, please let me know down in the comments below or on my Instagram account. You can find me at trendy underscore Talia. I would love to hear from you guys and know what you thought of it. Once again, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye girl!